The topic for today is our Tanren Kata, or our fundamental Kata. And if you practice multiple, you need to be able to specify the differences and benefits that you get from each of them independently. Because if they each serve the same purpose, you really only need one. So for example, I personally practice Sanchin, Papuren, and Rokishu. So they each serve slightly different purposes. Whereas Sanchin is the core fundamental kata, teaches the home base framing that I move into and out of for all of my body dynamics, teaches me to build the habit of keeping my elbows in and my shoulders down and lots of other things. Then I would move into Papuren, where I go from Sanchin's neutral wrist position into a pronated position, and then I would add to and expand on the body dynamics for rotation and vertical power generation from there. And then I would move into Rokishu, getting a supinated grip and focusing on the heavier and stickier aspects of movement, all of which relate to the same method of movement that I'm teaching overall. So maybe go through all of your fundamental kata and see if you can specify what the differences are between them and why you practice each of them, but also how they relate to each other into building one method of movement for your practice as a whole. Have fun. Thanks for watching. See you next time.